Yay! We're seeing who can build the best volcano house in Minecraft. Ooh, my volcano's gonna be so eruptious. Uh, did bro really just say eruptious? But anyways, I gotta grab some blocks for my volcano. Here, let me grab a little bit of stone, uh, a little bit of cobblestone. What else? What else? Ooh, a little bit of mossy cobblestone. This volcano is gonna be the most sick volcano ever. Ooh, what about some of this block as well? And here, I guess to start building my volcano, the first thing I gotta do is start building a big circle of all of these blocks down here on the floor. I'm just gonna put down a bunch of these blocks in like a random pattern just like this. This is gonna be the most sick volcano you've ever seen. Okay, and then... Boom! Wait, uh, did that work? What the heck? Ruby, is that your volcano? Uh, I'm stuck in it, but uh, yes. Uh, did you just build that with commands like instantly? Wait, what does it look like? I can't see anything. Uh, uh, it looks kind of good. Um, I mean, it's kind of going on to my side. You might want to make it a little bit smaller. Wait, it broke some of my volcano. I can't see anything, so uh, let me let me just uh, do that again. Wait, it was that big? I think you should definitely make it a little bit smaller. Oh, jeez. All right, well, anyways. I'm gonna get back to building my volcano and whoa, what the Kim, you have so much progress on wait. How are you guys building so much faster than me? Oh, I'm using commands, bro. I'm getting this done fast. Oh, yeah, right, right. Hold on. I'm like the only one who's not using commands. Okay, hold on. What I need to do is grab a shovel really quick, and then if I hold out this shovel, and here now, if I just go ahead and run this brush command, boom, there we go. I've just turned my shovel into a brush, and now I can just draw with all these blocks that I have. Let's go! Wow, that looks cool, but that's gonna take so long. Um, let me just uh do this. And oh no, but you just built another volcano and oh, there you go. This one's a lot smaller now and ooh, you made it out of obsidian this time. That's kind of cool. It looks pretty good, doesn't it? It does look pretty good, but that, wait, Ruby, hold on. Volcanoes are supposed to be like kind of like random looking. Yours kind of just looks like a pyramid. Uh, it can be random looking on the inside. Uh, okay, okay, if you say so. But anyways, here, my volcano is actually coming along great. This is looking really good so far. I think the blocks that I chose look really nice. So here, I just got to start making it go up now and actually start looking like a volcano. And whoa, wait, Cam, yours is kind of just looking like a mountain. Uh, yeah, because I'm not done yet. Give me a second. All right, all right. One. There you go. You've been given a second. All right, bro. All right, all right. Well, anyways, here, I'm just gonna keep building up the walls of this volcano. This thing is actually gonna look crazy. I'm gonna make it so that my volcano can actually erupt. How are you gonna do that? Uh, I've got plans. Don't worry about it. But here, I just gotta keep working up on these walls. It's kind of slow, but it's all gonna pay off in the end. It's gonna look super sick. I'm probably gonna have the best volcano here. I'm still building mine, so I wouldn't say you have the best one. Uh, you guys are taking so long to build your volcanoes. Mine's already almost Done. What the heck? Okay, but yeah, Ruby, ours is gonna look a lot better since, you know, we're actually, uh, you know, taking the time to make it look random and stuff. Yours, like I said earlier, kind of just looks like a pyramid. Hey, are you saying that I didn't put any thought into it? Uh, uh, no, no. Uh, uh, yeah, actually, yeah, kind of. Well, you're wrong and you'll see. Okay, okay, if you say so, but hold on. I want to get a view of how my thing's looking so far. And Whoa, this thing's actually looking super good. Okay, mine is definitely gonna be the best one here. And whoa, wait, Kim, I see you've done some updates to your volcano. I see you changed the blocks. Yep, I'm making it awesome. Okay, okay, but but wait a minute, guys. Don't forget, this is still a volcano house build challenge. I kind of forgot about the house part. We still have to build a house inside of the volcano. Uh, yeah, that's why I made mine so big. Mine's gonna be super comfy on the inside. Ooh, all right, all right. And I think mine should be pretty good as well. I've got a lot of room on the inside, so I should have plenty of space to build a ginormous house. In fact, I'm gonna build a whole mansion in here. Here, I just gotta finish up building these walls first. This is taking kind of a while. I just gotta keep going up over here like this. I'm almost at the end. There we go. There we go. Come on. We're almost at the top. This thing is actually looking awesome. Not as awesome as mine. Anyway, how's yours looking so far? And, uh, uh, yours kind of looks like a volcano. It kind of looks more like just like mountain. Well, mine's the only one with lava, so you guys are really not winning right now. And oh, wait. Actually, you are kind of right. You are kind of the only one with lava right now. And Oh, no. Wait, Kim. You have lava as well. Oh, gosh. Okay. I got to catch up. Yep, Dash. You're the only one without lava. Okay. Okay. Well, I'm adding the lava right now. Here. I just finished up all the walls, so I'm just going to build a little platform up over here for the lava. There we go. That's looking pretty awesome. And here, let me grab a lava bucket and I'm just gonna fill up this area with a bunch of lava. This volcano is actually gonna look crazy here. Let me just put down all of this lava. There we go. And all right, it's looking pretty good, but ooh, I should add a little bit of lava dripping down the sides. That can make it look a lot nicer. Let's just add some over there. A little bit of lava over here. Why not? And have some over there, some here. We just gotta have it going all the way around the entire volcano. Just like that. And okay, I think this should be enough lava just dripping around the sides of the volcano. But anyways, now I gotta make the volcano actually erupt. So here, the way I was thinking we could do that is, let me just go inside of the volcano really quick. I just gotta go right over here underneath all the lava and uh, let me grab some signs. Pretty much what we gotta do is put down a bunch of signs over here underneath all of the lava. And then what I'm gonna do is break the blocks on top of it so that the lava is just like sitting on the sign. And then pretty much what this is gonna allow me to 
do is make it so that I can shoot stuff outside of my volcano so that it looks like it's like actually erupting, you know? But here, the first thing I actually gotta do is put down all of these signs. So let's just do that right now. Oh, Dash, you're really making your volcano eruptious. And yep, I'm making this thing super eruptious. I just finished putting down all of these signs. And now what I gotta do is break all these blocks so that the lava can just uh, sit on the signs. Please never say eruptious ever again. Uh, well, why? They, I'm just saying eruptious. You keep on trying to make it a thing. It's never gonna be a thing. No, what? What's, what's wrong with the word eruptious? It's perfectly fine. No, it's not. What word should we use instead? Erupt? Volcano e. That's a better word. What volcano e? No, no way. Eruptious is way better than volcano e. No way. Eruptious doesn't even sound real. I'm pretty sure it's real. Wait, is it, Cam? Yeah, go look in the dictionary. It's real, bruh. Is it really? Either way, my volcano is still gonna be the most eruptious one here. And all right, right now, what I'm doing is just building a little platform underneath all of the signs. And then what I'm gonna do on this platform is build a big TNT cannon that shoots TNT up through the volcano. That way, it's gonna look like the volcano is actually erupting. So here, using commands, let me just go ahead and set all of this floor into some stone. There we go. And all right, now it's time to build our TNT cannon over here. So what we gotta do is grab some dispensers. And here, what we gotta do is build a little circle of dispensers just like this. And then in the middle, let me grab some water and a fence really quick. And here, what we're gonna do is just put down all this water over here like that and then put down this fence in the middle. And now the next thing we gotta do is fill up all the dispensers with some TNT. So let's just put some TNT in in over here and uh, pretty much just fill up all the dispensers with TNT and boom there we go they are now all filled up but anyways the next thing we got to do is put another dispenser down right over here like that and then let me grab some redstone and some repeaters and here we just got to connect everything together and hold on I think we actually have to break this dispenser down over here it's fine though we don't actually need it uh, I'm sure all the other dispensers are going to be enough and what we have to do instead is put some repeaters going into this dispenser up here so let's just put down all these repeaters like like that and then connect everything up with some more redstone and okay I think this machine should be done I'm not gonna lie this looks pretty sketchy but uh I guess there's only one way to find out if it works it's time for a test here let me just hit this button over here and okay come on please work please work it looks pretty promising I think it's gonna work come on and oh no okay that did not sound good that everything blow up down here come on come on hopefully nothing blew up and Okay, phew. At least everything didn't blow up. Blowing up? Are you okay, Dash? Yep, yep, yep. I'm fine. My volcano was just uh, being a little bit too eruptious. I think what the problem was is that we have to replace this fence over here with a slab. Okay, let's try this out. Let me try hitting the button one more time. Okay, hopefully this works. Come on, come on. Launch the TNT up, please. Come on. And yes, that actually worked. Wow. Okay, that is actually so awesome. Did you guys see that? Uh, no, I'm inside my volcano, so I didn't see anything. Wait, Dash, what did you do? And, uh oh, okay, you want to see this. Uh, let me just go inside over here and press the button again and all right check this out uh, my volcano is about to get eruptious here we go and let's go you're firing tnt out of your volcano that's so eruptious i know i know that is the most eruptious thing ever and whoa what are these are these like magma balls going outside of your volcano oh my gosh please stop saying eruptions yeah they're sort of like meteors i built them because they look cool whoa that's pretty awesome and, but ruby i'm gonna keep using eruptious it's kind of a cool word yeah, your volcano is not even eruptious it's just got a bit of lava yeah your volcano is like dribbly. I wouldn't really call this eruptious. It's more like in the dribbly category. Well, I don't want to be eruptious, okay? You'd rather be dribbly than eruptious? I don't even know what dribbly means. It means like you're dribbling. Look, like your volcano is there's like lava dribbling down the side. Uh, you just got the dribbler mentality. What is that even? Me. Pretty simple. You've just got the dribbler mentality. Me personally, I've got the eruptious mentality. But anyways, I'm going to add a few more dispensers over here in my uh, erupting area. And what I'm going to do inside of these dispensers is grab some fireballs. That way, not only will my volcano be shooting out TNT, but it's also going to be shooting out fireballs and it's going to look super sick. And hold on, I'm pretty sure we can get like some special types of fireballs. And yeah, check it out. We can get an ember charge. Whoa, this looks kind of cool. And whoa, wait, we can also get a magma charge. Hold on, hold on. I want to test this out. Let me grab a lever really quick and uh, just put some of these uh, magma charges and ember charges inside of this dispenser. And all right, here, let me try flicking this lever. Let's see what these things do. And oh, wait, something happened. Wait, what, the, where, where did it go? Did it get stuck in the lava? Hold on, wait, wait, is the fireball not going past the lava? And Oh, wait, that, that one definitely went past the lava. What the heck happened? Hold on, hold on. Let me try spamming this lever a few times. There we go. And whoa, okay. Yeah, it looks like it's getting stuck in the lava and then going back down. Wait a minute. That actually still does look kind of cool. What about I grab some redstone and repeaters? And here, if I just go here and make a quick infinitely repeating redstone signal just like this. Let me try connecting this to the dispenser now. And all right, let's see. How does this look? And whoa, that looks pretty cool from the outside. That looks pretty eruptious. I can't lie. Hold on, hold on. I think I definitely have to do some more of this. That is 
looking pretty cool. Let's go ahead and turn this one off for now and oh wait I think we ran out of stuff in the dispenser. Yeah, but here check it out What we got to do is put a bunch of these dispensers all around this area in our volcano and inside of all of them Let's grab some more of these magma charges and yeet them in Let's just go ahead and put down a bunch of these dispensers all across this area Just like that and now what we got to do is connect them all together with some redstone uh, here Let's just have the redstone go like this and then I think we can have a repeater over here. Yep, that works Let's have another piece of redstone going over here this way and all right Let's see how is this gonna look from the outside? Let's check it out and whoa that is looking pretty eruptious all right well that's pretty awesome but here let's go ahead and turn it off for now because it is kind of loud and i guess we can just turn this back on whenever we want our volcano to erupt or something but hmm all of this is pretty cool but it's not quite erupting yet how much more erupting do you want i want to have a lot of erupting and here i think i know how i can make my volcano erupt a lot and the way i can do that is by using a lava tnt hold on wait i need to test this thing out really quick i'm just gonna go far out over here and put down one of these lava tnt TNTs. I'm pretty sure what this thing does whenever it ignites is just spawn in a big pool of lava So uh, let's just try this out. Is it gonna go off and yeah, check it out It just spawns in like a bunch of lava So what I was thinking is I can just go over here inside of my volcano and uh, I'm just gonna put a bunch of lava TNT everywhere uh, I guess I can put a little bit over here a little bit down there some over here like that I'm pretty much just gonna line up this entire top part of my volcano with some lava TNT uh, Isn't that like dangerous? Uh, kind of if I'm not careful, but I'm gonna be super careful the only time that i'm gonna light it off is when i want my volcano to erupt so here we're just gonna have a bunch of it there like that and okay there's a lot of tnt in here this is getting kind of scary but hmm wait a minute how are we gonna light all of this lava tnt all at once and oh, wait a minute i think i know how i can do that let me grab a little bit of normal tnt and uh we're just gonna put down a little bit of normal tnt pretty much what we're gonna have to do is light the normal tnt and then the normal tnt is gonna explode and that's gonna light the lava tnt that way we should be able to light all the lava TNT at once. But anyways, I think that should be about enough for the erupting part of my volcano. Now I gotta build the house part of my volcano. So uh, let's go back inside. And all right, time to build the house. But hold on, wait, let's go back outside again. Where do we build the entrance for the volcano? We can't really have it be up here at the top. That's uh, a little bit scary. Here, why don't we just build the entrance on the side of the volcano right over here? This could work. Let's just dig ourselves a nice little entrance right over here off to the side of the volcano just like that that is looking pretty nice and ooh, wait a minute i have a really cool idea to make it so that this entrance looks kind of hidden let me grab a few ghost blocks and pretty much what these ghost blocks are they look like normal blocks but you can go through them and what we're gonna do is just cover up this entire entrance with a bunch of these ghost blocks that way no one's gonna be able to break into my volcano because they're not gonna know where the entrance is so there we go let's just put down some ghost blocks and okay yeah that is looking very natural it kind of just looks like a normal part of the volcano but this is actually the entrance that is sick all right, well, anyways, now it's time to actually build the house part of this volcano. So, uh, hmm, what do I need to do first for a house? I guess the first thing I gotta do is build, like, a bedroom and all that stuff. So, here, let me grab a few stairs. We can just have a few stairs over here to get down. Just like that. And, all right, now we gotta build the actual, uh, room. So, I guess the first thing we can do is build the bedroom right over here. I was thinking we can just build the bedrooms off to the side of the volcano. And then we could have, like, bridges inside of the volcano connecting everything. I think that could look pretty awesome. So, here, let's just go ahead and have a bunch of stone bricks here for the floor next let's go ahead and build the walls and roof there we go and ooh, why don't we make this side of the wall all be made out of glass this could look pretty sick the bedroom is kind of just gonna look like a big floating room that looks awesome here the next thing we gotta do is build a little bridge to get to it from the main entrance over here so there we go that's looking pretty nice oh no and wait what, what, what's going on um Oh, man, my dragon is breaking everything. And, uh, uh, what? Dragon? Wait, I just saw its tail sticking out your the roof. What is going on? Um, I have a pet fire dragon. Duh. What? You have a pet fire dragon? Can I see it? And, whoa, what the heck? Yeah, I'm trying to figure out what to feed her. That is, uh, the one big fire dragon. You should probably feed her, uh, let's see. What type of fire food is there? Ooh, what about a firefish? Firefish? I can try that. Yeah, there you go, uh, dragon, um. Uh, okay, I'm, I'm just gonna leave you to it. Uh, good luck with your fire dragon. I don't think she wants to eat it. Oh, gosh. Okay, that looks pretty scary. But uh, anyways, I'm gonna go back to working on my volcano. Uh, here, the next thing I gotta do is add a door to this room. So uh, let me grab a door real quick and just...
just put that down right over there like that. That's looking pretty sick. And all right, I guess this can be the bedroom. Let's grab some beds. We can put down a few beds right over here like that. And oh, whoa, okay, I have a cool idea. What we should do is add some windows off to the side. That could actually look really cool. That way you can have a cool view of everything that's going on outside. Here, let's just go ahead and keep digging off to the side of the volcano until we reach the surface. So uh, about here should be good. Nice, there we go. And all right, now let me grab a few glass panes and let's put those down right over here like this. Just like that. There we go. And ooh, that is looking awesome. Kim, I can get like a cool view of your volcano from here. This actually looks sick. Oh yeah, does my volcano look awesome? It looks pretty cool. Not as cool as mine, obviously, but uh, it's a pretty cool view. Uh, no, mine's definitely better than yours. What? Dude, no way. Yours is not even that eruptious. Does yours have TNT cannons? That's what I thought. No, mine has something better. It's going to self-erupt. You'll see. It's going to self-erupt. What? Yeah, you'll see. Uh, wait, what's the difference between self-erupting and non-self-erupting? I, I said it three times. You'll see. All right. Well, anyways, let's see. The next thing we should probably add to a bedroom is, uh, ooh, let's grab a few stairs and we could use these as like, I don't know, uh, bedside stands. This is where like I can put books and stuff on if I'm reading or something. But hmm, let's see. Is there anything else I might need in a bedroom? Ooh, wait, what about a desk? That could be pretty cool. I guess let me just build the desk right over here. Let me grab a few slabs and we could just build a nice wooden desk right here just like that. That is looking pretty nice. And we can have a chair over here. And then, ooh, wait here. Let me go ahead and grab one of these purple laptops and we could just put that down right over there like that. That is looking pretty awesome. All right, well, anyways, this bedroom area is looking pretty cool, but hmm, what other rooms do we need inside of a house? Let's see, let's see. <gasps> I'm gonna need to have a washroom, right? I completely kind of forgot about that. Okay, I cannot forget the washroom. That's like the, one of the most important parts of a house. I'm just gonna build a washroom off to the side right over here like this. The washroom doesn't have to be too big of a room. It can kind of be small. Let me just clear out a little bit of space for it right over here. And all right, I think this should be more than enough space for the washroom. Here, let's go ahead and grab a few quartz blocks and uh, we can just build the floor of the washroom all out of some quartz. Yeah, this washroom's gonna be super fancy. There we go. That's looking pretty good. And here, now let's build the walls of the washroom out of some more quartz blocks just like that. There we go. And all right. I think this washroom is looking pretty good. Let's also grab a door because that's going to be very important for the washroom. We do not want people just breaking in. Oh, so there we go. That's looking pretty nice. And all right. Now it's time to actually add the toilet and all that. So uh, here, let me go ahead and grab a cauldron and some water really quick. And uh, I guess this can be the toilet right over here. Yeah, there we go. And here, let's also grab one of these trap doors for the toilet uh, cover door thingy. We can just have that over there there and ooh, let's also grab a lever and we can just put that down over here this could be the flush yeah all right well that's looking pretty cool but now we also gotta build a sink for people to wash their hands so uh i guess we can just build the sink right over here what i was thinking is we can just put down a few trap doors here just like that and then let me put some water in the middle and a lever and boom there we go easy sink and hold on a minute i'm not gonna lie i kind of want to add a few windows in this room i think it'll make the room look a lot nicer and Whoa, wait, look, there's lava over here. Hold on, hold on, hold on. This could actually be really good. That way, no one's gonna, like, spy on you if you're using the washroom, but you can have, like, a really cool view of the lava. Okay, this washroom is actually gonna be the craziest washroom ever. Let's just have all those glass windows there, and then let's head outside really quick. And here, let's just make sure to cover everything up with lava so uh, the, the washroom stays, like, private. There we go. That is looking epic. Yo, let's go see what this looks like from the inside. Let's just head inside through our entrance over here. And, all right, bathroom, let's go check it out. Let's see what it's looking like and whoa that is looking sick we have like a whole lava window and this actually gives me a really good idea let's go back over here into the bedroom and all right check this out what if we go in each corner of the bedroom and just add some lava and then hold on let me break this block over here we can have lava streams in each corner of the room okay this is actually looking crazy and here just to make sure that everything is safe let's go ahead and put some glass around it as well just like that just to make sure that no one falls in and all right there we go that is looking awesome but hold up now we have some lava spilling to the bottom of our volcano but oh, wait this could actually be really cool let me grab a wand really quick let's just set the entire floor of our volcano down here into lava i think that could look really cool let's just do slash slash set lava boom and all right that's looking pretty awesome now we gotta fill up this whole place with lava i guess let me just grab a few lava buckets and we can just do this manually we don't need to use commands for this hey guys how's your volcanoes looking mine is looking very good right now mine's looking awesome did you manage to get your fire dragon under control uh she's just kind of chilling i think she's taking a bath oh oh in the lava yeah oh that's 
that's pretty nice. But wait, Cam, how's your volcano looking? Oh, my volcano's coming together pretty nicely. I already got my training room, and I'm working on my uh, jetpack area right now. Whoa, but you have a jetpack area? And wait, wait, what? Training room for what? Uh, to fight uh, mobs in a volcano, of course, duh. Uh, the, the, why do you have a mob fighting arena in your volcano? I gotta learn how to fight these volcano monsters, you know? Gotta get them gains. Uh, okay, if you say so. But anyways, I just fill up the bottom of my volcano with a bunch of lava. This is actually looking really sick. And anyways, let's see. What other rooms do I need? I've got the bedroom. I've got the bathroom. But hmm, what else? What else? Let's see. Let's see. Wait a minute. I think I have a really good idea. What if I build a sumo arena right above the lava down here? That could actually be really crazy. A sumo arena? Yeah, yeah. Pretty much what people are going to have to do is fight each other on a big circle. And first to fall into the lava loses. Whoa, that sounds pretty fun. Okay, I want to try it when you're done. Ooh, all right, all right. Yeah, it's going to be very epic. Uh, Here, I'm just building a ladder to get down to it now. I guess we can just have the ladder go like this. And then uh, we can have the arena be down over here let's build the arena out of some concrete we can use some purple concrete some uh, red concrete and some white concrete and here we can just build it right over here the arena is just like a big circle that's pretty much it well, actually i guess it's not really a circle it's kind of more a square but anyways there we go that's looking pretty good and hold on uh we're gonna have to move this ladder this ladder is kind of in the way so we can have the ladder go off to the side of the sumo arena just like this and then what we could do is make a little spectator area so this can be like where all of the spectators stand and you know they can see who's winning the fight and all that and okay i think that's looking pretty good here we should add a little bit of glass in between the spectators and the actual uh, sumo arena because we don't want people on the sumo arena jumping off to the spectator area that would be kind of cheating so here let's just put down all of this glass over here blocking off the spectators just like that and okay i think that should be good but hold up now we need a way to actually get onto the sumo arena and ooh, actually i guess what we could do for that is let's just build a little pathway over here we can just have a little pathway connected to the main ladder just like that and this can be where the sumo fighters stop and hop onto the arena just like that and anyways i think this sumo arena should be about done hold up wait ruby you said you wanted to test it out right yeah all right well why don't you pull up the sumo arena is now complete oh my gosh okay i'm on my way oh can i spectate and yeah yeah everyone pull up uh the, my entrance is right over here uh, wait, ruby it's behind you o over here you see where i am oh okay. yeah yeah we have to go through these ghost blocks right over here and this is how we get inside of my volcano well this looks pretty cool all right well i would to see you guys fight uh where's the sumo area and all right everyone follow me right down over here we have to go down these ladders to get to the sumo area and all right ruby we have to stop over here since we're the ones fighting up and then we just have to hop onto the sumo arena and all right I i'm ready to go wait let me switch to survival real quick okay all right there we go and okay are you survival are you ready mm -hmm. let's go all right all right well here uh, cam count us off all right, in three two one go 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 go, go, go. Oh. Right, let's go let's go take this oh, come on oh, okay no you you fall off. Come on, come on. I have to win this. I cannot lose in my own sumo arena. Take this. Come on. Wait, why is this actually harder than I thought? Wait. Oh, I'm no. Winning. I almost fell. I think I'm winning. Let's go. Come on, come on, come on. I have to win this. Wait. And yes, let's go. Oh, GG's dash one. Uh, yeah, I can feel that. And wait, Cam, you want to go next? I'm sure I'm down to go for a round. All right, I will hear a lineup right now. I'm the grand champion at sumo. Never uh, lost before. Undefeated champion. So uh, I'd be scared if I were you. Uh, yeah, sure. You're one and oh. Uh, let's just wait for Ruby to get here. Okay, guys, I'm here. Let's do this. All right, all right. Let's go, Cam. Are you in survival mode? And, oh, you indeed are. You ready to go down? Yeah, you're about to go down, boy. All right, all right we'll see. We'll see. Let's go in three. Two, one, let's go! Come on, come on, I cannot lose this! No! Wait, you're actually almost pushing me off! No! What? Woo! I'm just better than you! And what? Okay, no, 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 we gotta do a rematch. That was, uh, that, that was, I wasn't prepared. Uh, yeah, how are you not prepared? You had an entire practice round. No, 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 that, that actually wasn't a practice round. That was a real round, and I got tired from it, so that, yeah. Uh, Dash, you, you're just a sore loser. You lost. Get over it. Whoa, whoa, okay, well, here, Kim, why don't we do best of three? Yeah, he won't be a sore loser if he wins. Yeah, but he's not gonna win, because I'm the best at sumo. Whoa, he's really confident. Okay, okay, we'll see about that. Here, I'm heading back inside right now. Let me just hop down over here, and all right, Kim, it may be 1-0 for you, but it's about to be uh, the 1-1. One, one. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. 3 Two, no, no, whoa, 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 hold on, hold on. Ruby should count us off. She's a spectator. That did not count. Oh, oh, was I supposed to? Sorry, I was just watching because it was funny. Hold on, hold on. Wait, I'm coming back. Uh, yeah, to make it fair, let's have Ruby count us off. Let me just hop back down over here. And all right, all right, here, Cam, let's line up. And all right, Ruby, uh, you, you count us off this time. Okay, and three. And two, and we'll go! All right, all right, let's go, Cam, you're going down! No, you are, Dash, bye-bye! No, 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 I don't do losing. Come on, I need to push you off it. What? How did I lose again?
again. Because I'm the best, and uh, that makes it 2-0. You just got insta-KO'd. Okay, okay, well, come on, come on. I can still win this. Uh, it may be 2-0, but uh, if I win the next three games, I win. Uh, yeah, but that's not going to happen. Uh, Ruby, count us down so I can win. Okay, 3, 2, 1, go! And, all right, let's go. Come on, Cam, you're going down. Take this! Uh, no, Dash. Uh, uh, wait, what? Uh, yes, you... let's go! Whoa, he exploded. Oh, my gosh. About time. It's fine. It's 2-1. to one. I can just win the next round, and it's over. Oh, it's too late for you, Cam. I'm warmed up now. I'm on. A, I'm going on a winning streak. Uh, yeah, sure. Well, uh, hold on. Let me just come back. Get in there. Yeah, yeah. Pull up, pull up. Uh, Ruby, you want to count us off again? Okay. And three, two, and um, almost there. And one, go. All right, let's go. Let's go. Come here, Kim. I got to take you down. Come on. Yes, wait. Turn around. Let's go. Easy. How did that happen? Oh, my gosh. That was crazy. Dude, the tables just turned there. Uh, it's fine. I'll just win the next round. Okay, okay. But wait, Kim. Now the score is 2-2. Two, two. Whoever wins the next one wins it all. Okay, this is for everything. Yeah, I'm going to win the next one. Let's go. All right, well, okay. wait, 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 wait. No, no, that was not a countdown. Wait, wait, that was not wait, a countdown. That wasn't me telling you to go. Stop. Okay. Ready, set, go. All right, all right, now we're going. Let's go. Come on, Kim. Let's go. Let's go. I'm going to do the same strategy. I just got to turn around you. Come on. Nope, that's not going to happen. And bye, Dash. And no, I was so close. Yeah, I let you win those two rounds. It was super funny watching you actually have a chance. And, what? Dude, you did not let me win that. You just got lucky that last round, okay? Dude, I literally walked off the platform both times. What? No, you did not. You got pushed off the platform. Uh, no. Anyway, uh, you're lost. Uh, fair and square. Mm, okay, well, I'll beat you later. I got some training to do. All right, well, I'm going to get back to building my volcano. Bye, guys. All right, all right. Well, here, let me head back over to my volcano. I got to do some building as well. I have some few ideas for upgrades I can do to the sumo arena. Here, the first thing we got to do is uh, we should probably make it so that whoever falls off doesn't just uh, die in the lava. We should probably have like some water down here. But hmm, if we just have water here, that's going to make everything look bad. So here, what I was thinking is using some signs, we can just go down here underneath the lava. And similar to what we did at the top of our volcano, we could just put down a bunch of signs over here to stop the flow of lava. And pretty much what this is going to do is make it so that if anyone falls down after they lose a game of sumo, they can land over here and at the bottom of this pit, we can have some water so they don't take too much damage. But hold on, wait, there's gonna be kind of annoying to do with all of this lava here. Let me just go ahead and drain all this lava real quick. I'm just gonna do slash slash drain 50. There we go. And all right, here, let's build our pit first and then put all the lava down. So here, we just gotta build a pit going around the entire arena just like this. And here, instead of making this pit only one block wide, we should probably make it at least four blocks wide like that. That way, if someone gets like punched off and they end up all the way over here, they still survive. So here, we can actually do this really quickly with commands. Let me just grab a magic wand real quick and uh, let me just select this position over here and then also this position all the way down over here and we're just gonna set all of this into some air. Boom, there we go. And all right, now we just gotta do this with every side of the arena. And there we go, the pit should be about done. Now what we gotta do is put down all of our signs. So we can just put down a bunch of signs over here on the ceiling. We literally gotta cover up the entire ceiling with signs. This might take a second. And boom, I just finished my jetpack training course. And ooh, nice, nice, nice. I can't wait to check it out on your side. That sounds pretty Pretty epic. Yeah, it's actually awesome. Uh, now I get to work on my mine shaft. Ooh, all right. And wait, wait, what? You're building a mine shaft in your volcano? Yeah, volcanoes have very rare resources like diamonds. Wait, what? Really? I haven't found any diamonds in my volcano. Uh, maybe because you're not looking hard enough. They're very deep into the volcano. Wait, really? I didn't know that. I didn't put any diamonds down. Well, that's because you built your volcano. If you find a natural volcano, then it, they give you like a ton of diamonds. Uh huh. Sure. Mm, okay, okay. Well, anyways, I've got all of these signs done. Now the next thing I gotta do is cover everything up with some more lava again. So let me just select these positions and do slash slash set lava. Boom. There we go. And all right, hopefully none of the lava goes beneath the signs. And yes, let's go. I think it's good. Here, let's go ahead and fill everything up down here with some more lava again. Here, now let's just go ahead and fill up this entire bottom part of the volcano with a little bit more lava again. So there we go. And all right, there we go. Everything should be covered in lava now. And here, the best part is now if someone falls off the sumo arena, they can safely land into a big pit over here. And hold on. It's not that safe right now because they're still going to be like uh, on fire down here if they fall through the lava. So what we got to do next is fill up this floor with a bunch of water. So here, I'm just going to do slash slash set water. Boom. There we go. Let's set all of this floor over here into some water. So there we go. That's looking pretty nice. And you know what? Let's make this room also look nice. I'm feeling quartz for this room. I think quartz will look really nice. So, ooh, yeah, that's looking pretty sick. Let's also set the walls into some quartz. So slash slash walls, quartz. Boom. There we go. And ooh, also, of course, we got to set the floor. And all awesome. This is looking sick. But hold up, hold up. We should probably also add a way to, you know, get out of this room if you do fall off in sumo. So what I was thinking is we could just extend this ladder over here and just have it go all the way down over here. So just like this, let's just
let's just dig down a few blocks over here and oh wait hold on oh no wait i i think we kind of broke something we put we broke the lava to go down here oh gosh hold on let's put down some ladders here so that the lava can't float there we go and, oh gosh wait this ladder is kind of annoying to build but come on let's just extend that and okay i think this should work let's just put down a few more ladders over here like that and okay there we go i think this works this looks a little bit strange since we literally just have lava on the side over here but uh, it, it works let's also go ahead and make everything look nice let's set all the walls here into some stone bricks and of course let's set the walls over here into some more quartz there we go that is looking pretty safe all right well anyways i think this area should be pretty much done we've got the water down here and now we've even got a way to get out of here if you manage to fall off all right well perfect i think the sumo arena is officially complete but hmm wait a minute i do kind of have one more idea for one last thing we can build for the sumo arena and uh, let me just quickly uh, run this command real quick. I'm just gonna give myself a stick with knockback five. And here, let me also go ahead and grab myself one of these secret chests. Pretty much what these things are. They pretty much look like normal blocks, but they're actually chests that you can open. And here, I'm just gonna go ahead and put a few of these knockback sticks inside of this chest over here. And all right, this is just gonna be my backup weapon in case I'm uh, losing to Cam again. Hold on, let me go ahead and test out this knockback stick on a cow really quick. Let's see what it does. And Oh, yep, I, I think that's definitely gonna let me win. All right, well, yeah, we're just gonna have those in a chest over there, and uh, no one's gonna know about that. We'll just leave that there. All right, well, anyways, we've got the bedroom, we've got the washroom, and we've got the sumo arena, but hmm, let's see. What else do I need to build inside of my volcano? I've got a bunch of stuff, and wait, what do you guys have inside of your volcanoes? Uh, let's see, I've got my bedroom, I've got a, a training course, and a jetpack training course, and a mine shaft, and uh, I'm planning on building some other stuff, too. Mm, okay, okay, and Ruby, wait, you have your dragon and all that stuff <gasps> wait a minute i think i have a pretty cool idea what if i build a roller coaster around my entire volcano wait that sounds like fun yeah that could be super cool that way i can get a cool view of the entire volcano and it could be uh it would be very eruptious very eruptious <laughs> all right here let me go ahead and grab a few rails and powered rails and uh ooh, i also need some mine carts and some redstone and all right it's mine carting time where are we gonna build this thing let's see how about we just build it off to the side over here we can just have a little bridge uh, going this way and here this could be where the start of the roller coaster station is gonna be let's just dig far out over here a little bit like that that looks pretty good let's go ahead and put down a few rails over here there we go let me also grab a button real quick and put that down over there and all right this is gonna be the start of the roller coaster track but uh hold on let's make this place look a little bit nicer first of all let's raise the roof a little bit because uh two block roofs is uh kind of disgusting let's just uh, raise that a little bit there we go and all right nice that's looking a lot better and here let's also grab a chest and we can just put that right over there and inside of this chest we can have all of our mine carts. And, uh, where did my horses go uh, wait what you had horses inside of your volcano oh my dragon ate them uh, what your dragon eats horses well i left them there for her but she was supposed to snack on them slowly not eat them all at once what the heck wait wait are you sure your volcano is like safe for us to go in later of course it's safe for you to go in are you sure your dragon's not gonna eat us um no because you're not a horse uh okay well i'm uh, good to know but anyways i'm just gonna continue my uh the roller coaster here let me just build these rails over here like this we gotta have this rail going all around the entire roller coaster it's gonna look sick here, let's build the actual platform for the roller coaster first and then we can start putting all of the rails on top of it so here what i was thinking is we could literally just have it go all around the entire roller coaster it could be like a big spiral going up to the top of the volcano all right so here we go we just gotta keep making it slowly turn higher and higher and hold on how are we gonna end the roller coaster wait what if we just make it so that it drops whoever is up in the roller coaster into the lava up here actually Hold on, wait, that probably won't work. What if they accidentally uh, press the button here and, you know, activate a bunch of stuff? Mm, okay, okay, let's see. <gasps> wait a minute, what about at the top of the roller coaster? We can have, like, an elytra so people can safely uh, elytra down the volcano. That should be pretty good. Here, let's just keep building up all the way to the top of the volcano. We just gotta go up like this. And hold on, actually, we should probably stop it right over here. I don't wanna go too high above the volcano because then what if the TNT cannon blows up the roller coaster? That would be pretty bad. Here, I guess let's just stop the roller coaster right over here. This could be the finish line. And here, now what we got to do is actually put some rails on this entire roller coaster so here let's grab our powered rails and normal rails and let's just start railing up this uh the roller coaster track yeah here what i'm gonna do is put down all of the rails first and then i'll power the rails later so here we just gotta have all the rails go like this there we go this is coming along nicely hopefully no one hops out of their seat mid-ride then they would probably fall into the lava uh yeah but maybe you should have some sort of like security system like some rails and stuff what the rails nah who needs rails you know uh 
just hold on tight and hope you don't fall off. That sounds really dangerous, Dad. What? Dangerous? Nah, I've literally got a sumo arena inside of my volcano. This is nothing compared to that. Yeah, well, still, that's very dangerous. Yeah, I'm gonna have to agree with Cam on this one. What? You guys think this is dangerous when my sumo arena wasn't? Well, at least with the sumo arena, you know what you're getting into. Yeah, Ruby's got a point. Okay, okay, well, you know what? Fine, I guess I'll put some helmets at the start of the roller coaster track if that makes you guys feel better. Yes, it does. All right, well, anyways, here, I'm just going and powering all of these rails on my roller coaster track right now. I'm just putting some redstone blocks underneath all of the powered rails to make sure that everything can stay powered. There's a lot of uphill on this roller coaster, so hopefully we have enough powered rails to make it all the way up to the top. So there we go, and all right, everything should be powered now. Now it's time to take it for a test spin. Hold up, let me put a roller coaster down over here and just hop in, and all right, guys, I'm about to take my uh, the minecart track for its first test spin, and oh, hold on, hold on, I need to grab a helmet. Yeah, please do not forget that. And wait, hold on, does this helmet look good? And whoa, this helmet looks pretty epic. Here, I'll put down a whole double chest over here filled with a bunch of these helmets. There we go, now it's all safe. All right, well, anyways, enough waiting around. It's time to take this thing for a test. Let's go, and okay, so far, pretty good. So far, I haven't fallen off or anything, and... All right, it looks like we're going up pretty quickly. I think we have enough powered rails. Let's go, let's go. We're almost at the top. Here we go, and boom. There we go, too easy. That was perfect. Absolutely nothing went wrong. All right, well, anyways, now all I gotta do is build the finish line area over here, and what we're gonna do is have an elytra over here so that people can just use an elytra to fly down across the volcano. It should be pretty epic. First, let's just have a few fences over here like that, and then let me grab a chest, and wait, we can just put down a chest right over there, and inside of it, we could put down a bunch of elytra. Elytras, let's go. All right, well, anyways, I think the roller coaster track is pretty much done. Here, let me just go ahead and add a little bit of black and white concrete here to show that it's the finish line. Here, I'll put it down over here. This looks pretty cool. And all right, sick. This place looks awesome. And anyways, I think that should be about it for my volcano. My volcano is looking sick. Let's go. Yep, my volcano's done too. And mine is as well. Ooh, let's go, let's go. <gasps> Wait, guys, now we gotta check out each other's volcanoes and see which one is the best. And whoa, Kim, can we check out yours first? Yours looks pretty crazy. Yeah, mine's definitely the best, so we'll check out the best first. What? No way, dude. We're just checking yours out first because uh, it's on the left side, yeah. Uh, uh, what do you mean it's why not? But uh, anyway, uh, if you guys want to come here, I can show you where the entrance is. All right, all right. And wait, for the entrance, do we just have to dive into the lava? Yep, Geronimo! Whee! Whoa, all right, all right. And ooh, I see you have some water down here. That's pretty nice and... Whoa, whoa, okay, you have a lot of stuff here. What the heck? Where do we start? Uh, I can't find the entrance. Ruby, you're supposed to just jump straight down. And, uh, wait, Ruby, I think you missed. You have to go, like, uh, over here, not there. Huh? Oh! Yeah, and, all right, where do we start inside? All right, well, I guess we can start all the way down here. Uh, this here is the training room. Ooh, all right, this is the training room you were talking about. And, wait, training room for what? I still haven't seen any of the mobs you have in here. Oh, yeah, hold on, let me grab one of my swords real quick. Oh, I'm gonna click the lever. Wait, let me grab a sword. All right, I got my sword now. You can summon them. And, uh, wait, Ruby's spamming the lever, but nothing's happening. It's not working. Uh, I think spamming the lever is breaking it. One second, and yeah, it's broken. Hold on. Oh, I'm sorry. And uh, what the heck? How did it break it? Whoa, wait, what, what, what just happened? Oh, oh, it's a blaze. Uh, yeah, hold on. Let me just uh, do this real quick. Uh, there we go. Hey, I just took out the blaze. That was too easy. Well, it's not just that. Hold on. All right, all right. All right, there we go. Now it should be fixed. About time. And wait, hold on. Do we get any weapons or anything? Do we need like a sword to do this? Oh, well, if you guys want to fight along, you can. I uh, Here, take that. And uh, Ruby, you can take that. And whoa, whoa, Ice Dragon Bone Sword. This thing looks sick. I like it. Here we go. Ready? This time to fight. And, whoa, what the heck? You have lava monsters here. Quick, quick, quick. We got to take them all out. Let's go. And whoa, these swords are awesome. Well, they freeze the enemies. That is sick. And wait, hold on. Can I use this on you? Whoa, I can. Huh? Oh, no. You just got ice blocked. And whoa, Kim, did you just spam it? What the heck? Yep. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Okay, hold on. We got a big wave. We got to take these out. Come on. Take this and... <laughs> Ruby, you still have ice around you. Oh, man. Those blue ones look strong. Whoa, what the heck? There's blue ones as well. Okay, hold on. I'm targeting the blue ones. Take this. Come on. Let's go. Where'd you even get these lava monsters from? They just spawned in the volcano, so I grabbed them and used them in here. Wow. Fair enough, but here, come on. We got to take these last few out. And yes, let's go. That was too easy. Ew, is that over? And yep, but uh, Ruby, you're still in an ice cube. Hold on. I think you need some... Uh, hold on. Let me grab some fire for you. Oh, uh, okay. There you go. Try walking in that and... 
Oh, uh, okay. It's a pretty big block of ice. It might take a while to melt. Oh, great. Now I'm stuck like this. All right, well, anyway, let's just move on to the next area up here uh, is my bedroom. Very decked out with the best equipment in the world for a bedroom. And Wow, very nice and creative bedroom. Yeah, I know. It took me uh, like an hour to think of this. What do you mean? It's just four beds placed together. Why do you mean, whoa? Uh, your creative mind cannot pro comprehend what I've got going on here. Whoa, they're even fireproof? Wow, that's pretty smart since like we're in a volcano. At least put a lamp down. Down. What? No, do not ruin my decor. What? Oh, 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 I promise I'm going to make it better. Here, just like one thing. See? No, no, no. You're ruining my decor. You're making it look all cluttered. Okay, whatever. Okay, okay. Well, anyways, let's go check out the next floor. It seems like you have a bunch of floors here. And all right, what's up on this one? Oh, this is the jetpack training course. And uh, I think you guys should, should go for a round. And oh, yeah, the jetpack training course. You were hyping this up. And whoa, this looks pretty crazy. All right, well, how do we do it? Well, you grab a jetpack and then you start flying. All right, all right. Well, here, I got the jetpack on and oh. Wait, hold on. Do I have to go in survival mode? Sure do. There you go. All right. Thank you very much. And whoa, wait, I'm jetpacking. Let's go. In. Whoa, wait, this is actually kind of tough. We have to like not fall into the lava. Yeah, it makes you go up and down too fast. And ow, wait, this is actually kind of hard. Hold on. Ow! Yeah, that's why it's a training course to help you get better. Wait, Ruby, maybe this will unfreeze the ice on you. And oh, it did not. Come on, come on. I got this. Come on. I have to win. Let me just go this way and... Oh, no, I did not make it. Yeah, it's very tough. It's more than just tough. This is bad design. I know. It's supposed to be hard because if it was easy, then it wouldn't be a good training course. And wait, wait, guys. I'm about to make it to the end. Come on, come on in. Yes, let's go. I made it too easy. Oh, nice, Dash. Let's go. And wait, it says great job. Now head back. Oh, no. Yep, that's all you got to do is you got to head back. Okay, okay, well, here, check it out. I'm about to head back without hitting the lava once. Let's just go over here like this. And oh, no, I hit the lava. It's over. Okay, well, let's just move on to the next area. Yeah, I don't like this. Well, anyway, uh, guys, uh, this is uh, my mine shaft. As you can see, we've been going for a little while. And whoa, okay, you have been mining for a while down here. Wait, how far does this roller coaster go? And wait, what's in the chest? Oh, more mine carts. All right, guys, I'm heading out. See ya. Wait, what? It's not a roller coaster, but uh, you're, we're going to be here for a very, very long time. What the? Does it just keep going? I can't even see the end. Uh, yeah, it goes for about uh, 8,000 blocks. What the? Okay, okay. Well, you know what? I I'm going to hop out of this minecart. I, I, I think I'll pass. But anyways, was that your entire volcano? Yep, that's it. Ooh, all right, all right. Well, that was pretty cool. I think I'll rate it a solid uh, 6 out of 10. Um, I'll rate it like a 7 because I think it's bigger than mine. Uh, what, 6 out of 10, Dash? Why only a 6? Uh, well, because you kind of have exposed grass here. That's kind of like a minus 4 points right there. That's just part of the decor. Plus, you're not supposed to be able to get there. Yeah, but I can see it. And, you know, it's negative points. Plus, your redstone didn't work. That's because Ruby spanned the lever. Uh, anyway, I, I should deserve a higher score than six. I gave you a seven. Yep, you got a seven and a six, and that puts your total score at 13. But wait, Ruby, can we check out your volcano next? Oh, heck yeah. Let's do it. Let's go. Yeah, we got to save mine for last since it's probably the best one, but whoa. All right, where do we start in this thing? Well, you start from the outside. Um, right here, we have a little thing that makes the volcano erupt. Check this out. Let's see it. Let's see it. And whoa, wait, you have fireworks to make your volcano erupt? That's actually pretty cool. Yeah, doesn't that look awesome? Wait, Cam, does your volcano erupt as well? Uh, yeah, but you don't want to see it. Uh, wh why not? Uh, we'll just wait until after your tour, and then I'll show it to you. Uh, okay. But anyways, Ruby, how do we go in? Do we just, like, jump down here into the lava or something? No, there's electrons from this chest right here. Oh, oh, I see, I see. Okay, here, let me grab an elytra real quick. And all right, let's hop in. Let's go in. Whoa, whoa, wait, actually, wait, there's a dragon there. Oh, gosh, oh, gosh, oh, what the heck? too fast, ow! Wait, why is everything on fire? My head hurts. And yeah, wait, why is everything on fire? Is your dragon fire breathing everywhere or something? <sighs> Not again. What the, and... Oh, no. Uh, wait, is this all the horses for your dragon to eat? Yeah, I put down more horses because all the other ones were gone. Oof, and it looks like these ones right now are burning. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, well, uh, let me just uh, take you around. So just follow me this way. Um, Let's go to my room first. Oh, uh, I'm sorry to say, but it looks like your room's kind of broken. I think your dragon may have... Uh, oh, wait, no, the dragon, don't look at me. Uh, uh, I'm nothing. I didn't say anything. I'm not a snack. Oh, no, what is she doing? <sighs> Sorry about her, but um, here's my bed. Here's my late night kitchen snack area. All right, all right, that's looking pretty cool. But wait, why do you have an item frame with TNT here? Well, I had a little shelf with all my favorite things here, but she destroyed it. So um... uh, uh, it looks like she's destroying some more stuff. Oh no, she's destroying the house. Oh uh, my house. Um, just a. Uh... I'll just let her do whatever she wants. <laughs> uh, all right, all right. Although, I don't think there's a very good pet. Maybe you should, like, uh, let her go or something. No, it's fine.
time. And over here, I have a little ore area. Ooh, all right, all right. Well, uh, the what's next? Wait, are, are these cows over here? Is this more snacks for your dragon? Oh, yeah. The cows were actually supposed to be in the restaurant over here, and then they got let out. Um, So I switched it with pizza ovens. But this is her bed. This is extra food for her. And then this is where I eat right here. And wow, okay, this is pretty cool. But uh, I will say there's a lot of fire here. Are you sure this is all safe? Um, yeah, if I live in a volcano, I'll have to be prepared for fire anyways, right? And, oh, yeah, true, true. You are right about that. And, whoa, what is this? And over here, we have a little beach. Oh, you just have a lava beach. Nice. Let me fix the umbrella really quickly. Um, But this is where I like to stay, right here. Cannonball! Woo! Ow. And, uh, uh, Everything uh, hurts. Uh, I don't think that was a good idea. All right, well, anyways, was that your entire volcano? No, it wasn't. Um, I have two more things. So I have this dance floor right here. Ah, 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 and, uh, uh, help me! Oh, help oh me. no! Oh no! Help the dragon's eating cute! Oh my gosh! No! <laughs> Oh, no. Obviously, that was Cam's fault. Well, how was it my fault your dragon ate me? Um, you made her mad. I didn't do anything. I was standing still. Hey, Cam, Cam, I'd get out of the way if I were you. She's trying to eat you again. You run, 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 Cam, go. Oh, don't hit her. Leave hurts. her alone. Oh. She's trying to eat Cam. Uh, okay, okay. Let, let, let's just move on. Let, let's get past the dragon. Is this... What, what, what is this? This is the bathroom. Uh, what? It's just... Okay. Uh, well, anyways, was that your whole volcano? Um, no. I have a spleef right here. How do I get out of here? The dragon's after me! You want to play spleef, Dash? Um, uh, sure. I, I, I guess we can play some spleef and... Oh, no. The dragon is spinning around. I think the dragon's trying to escape. Where's the exit to this volcano? Kim, watch out! Watch out! Where's the exit? How do I leave? Oh, I might have forgotten to make one. What the? Oh, gosh. All right. Well, I, I guess we can play a quick game of Spleef. Let me grab a shovel from here. Uh, let's just be really quick because the dragon is uh, looking at me weird. Oh, oh no. Please hurry. I want to get out. Okay. Just don't fall in the lava. All right. Uh, well, let's go. This is a uh, very, very good Spleef. Wait, isn't this so fun, Dad? Yeah, yeah. This is it is really good. But I get you a... Oh, my oh, gosh. What oh, are those sounds oh, that the dragon's oh, making? Oh. And oh, the way. I win. Let's go. Ruby one, can we get out of here now? Please, 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 please. Okay, fine. Okay, fine. Um, This lava over here going to the outside is fake lava. So you can just go in. And it. oh, okay. It gives me fire resistance. All right. Well, I'm just going to fly my way out. All right. That was uh, a pretty interesting volcano. I think I rated a solid uh, three out of ten. What? After getting eaten by a dragon, I'm giving it a one. That was awful. What? How come I got a lower score than Cam? Uh, you got to have had like a wild dragon in, in your volcano. That wasn't quite the best experience. Anyway, uh, let's hope that Dash's uh, volcano is better. And oh, yeah, guys, don't worry. My volcano is a lot better. Everyone, uh, follow me over this way. Okay, fine. All right, well, uh, th th are we starting inside your base, Dash? And yep, we are starting inside. And wait, wait, actually, no, we are not. I forgot to show you guys something. Everyone, uh, stand out over here. I'm just gonna uh, hop inside of my volcano real quick. Uh, okay. And all right, everyone, check this out. I'm about to turn on my eruption mode here. Let me just go ahead and turn this on really quick and let me press Whoa, this button and that? all right guys the volcano is about to erupt let's go hopefully this doesn't like blow everything up and <gasps> let's go that was awesome Whoa, what was that that was my eruption mode and wait did anything break down here is everything still intact and yep everything is still working right over here is where i have all my equipment for uh, erupting everything that's so cool Yep, Cam, this TNT is for when we want to do a full eruption. Uh, I'll show you what a full eruption looks like later. Oh, okay. Uh, well, uh, can we, like, look at the rest of the inside of your base? And, yep, here, we can do that. Everyone, follow me right over here. This is the entrance. You guys already saw the entrance earlier, but, uh, anyways, you know, my base is pretty good. I've got, uh, you know, a little bedroom area over here, and... Oh, wait, there was supposed to be lava here, but I think I uh, drained it by accident earlier. Let me grab some more lava. And here, let's put it down over here. And all right, this is what it's supposed to look like. What do you guys think? Oh, that looks uh, pretty cool, actually. Oh, that's so cool. Is that a lava lamp? And oh, oh yeah, I, I, I guess it kind of is a lava lamp, like a really big lava lamp. But anyways, uh, the next area is over here. This is the washroom. I see you've already discovered it, Cam. <laughs> And, uh, what the heck is? Are you holding your poo? Where else am I supposed to put it? Uh, there, there, there's a toilet there for a reason. Hey, finish your business. You're not, you're not supposed to use a toilet on the tour. Okay, I used it. Oh my gosh! All right, that but yeah, that's so that's gross. the washroom, and uh, but we can just move on. Uh, the next area is right over here. This is the roller coaster track. So everyone, grab a minecart and also a helmet. Uh, I would advise that, and uh, you can just hop onto the roller coaster. Can I go first? Uh, sure. Yeah, you can go first, Cam. Let's go. All right. Whee! Let's go! Okay, and here I go. Whoa! Let's go, let's go! Isn't this roller coaster sick? Whoa! I think I'm going to be motion sick. <laughs> oh, 
lot of turns. It's not that bad. It, wait, Tim, did you just throw up on my roller coaster? What the heck? Uh, a lot of turns. Why does it keep on zigzagging? But that, how else am I going to turn? And anyways, uh, you guys uh, made it to the end successfully. And uh, over here, you can grab some elytras. And you can just use the elytras to elytra around the entire volcano. Ow, I fell into the lava. Cam, you didn't activate it right. I'm still dizzy from the roller coaster. You're really bad at using elytras, Cam. All right, well, anyways, um, now we can head back inside. That's about everything on the outside of my volcano. But now I got to show you guys the updated sumo area. And Cam, we got to have a rematch, all right? Uh, okay. Well, there's more? Yep, yep. I've made some changes. So uh, here. Let's get in positions. Hey, okay, take off that elytra and that helmet, all right? Okay. No armor allowed. And here, now let me just set us all into survival. There we go. And all right, Cam, you ready to go down? Yeah, I'm ready. And wait, 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 wait. No, no. Ruby's counting down. Yep. And let's go in three, two, one. One, all right, go. let's go. And uh, by the way, we're doing a uh, first to three uh, again. Uh, you suck at losing. Uh, uh, I mean, winning. Uh, there you go. Bye bye. Dash wins. Wait, no. no uh, okay, he Cam, you may have won the win. first round, but hold on. I'm coming back. I'm coming back. And wait, hold on. Where did you go? Did you not die? And, nope. I actually made a landing platform down over there for when you fall off. And okay, hold on, guys. I think it's time for uh, my cheating stick. I'm just gonna grab that really quick. And all right, Cam, let's go. Round two. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Let's go. In three, two, one. Go! All right, let's go, let's go, 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 go. Take this, yes! What? I, uh, uh, dash, that has to be cheating. What? How is that cheating? I told you I was going to train. No, that's it. You can't even knock someone back that far naturally. You had to cheat. Uh, no, dude, I just hit the gym and, you know, worked out. That was not cheating. Okay, so we're lying then? That's not lying. That's uh, one line. Wait, Ruby, what do you think? You're the referee. Um, I... Don't know. I think right now you guys are tied. And yeah, see, even Ruby says that we're tied. So come back down here, Cam. We got two more rounds to play. I'm burning. Uh, wait, what? You're burning? Oh, wait, yeah. I don't think you ended up in the um, uh, landing area. Yeah, because you cheated. But uh, anyway, I, I'm ready I now. did not cheat. I just knocked you back really far. But uh, anyways, Ruby, you can count us off again. You ready? Okay, I'm ready in three, two, one, go. Let's go. Let's go. And you're going down, Cam. Come on. Nope. You're going down, Dash. Hold on. I, I, let me just beat you real quick. And, uh, dude, you're not going to be beating me. In oh, no. Oh, no. Come on. No. And just like that, you even cheated and lost two to one. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. Whoa. Well, two one, two one, but I can still win this. And okay, I'm going to use the knockback stick next round. The score is now officially two to one. Cam is in the lead. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Well, not for long here. Let me just come back down here again. And all right, Cam, you ready for the next round? You're going down this time for sure. Uh, yeah, sure. I'm ready. Ruby, count us down. Uh, okay. There's a lot of counting. Um, three, two, one, go. All right, all right. Let's go and take this, guys. That has to be cheating. You are not that strong. Yes, I am. I, I practiced. That was not cheating. All right, fine. 2-2, two, two, but Ruby, count us down. Uh, okay, 3, 2, 1, go! All right, let's go! What? Right, you literally used a sword! Uh, yeah, you did too. I seen it. La, 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 la. Uh, I dude, no, I did not use a sword. I used a stick, okay? Sticks are allowed. What? How are sticks allowed or not swords? Uh, well, in my arena, my rules, all right? Well, uh, I win, so my rules. Uh, I think that neither of you win, and we've been here for too long. Let's go. And yeah, uh, Cam, I think you cheated. But anyways, that was my entire volcano. What do you guys think? Uh, I think uh, I'll rate it after you do the uh, eruption thing or whatever. And oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, you're right. You're right here. Everyone hop outside. I gotta do the full eruption. Let me just grab some flint and steel and, uh, all right. Goodbye, my volcano. This is probably gonna do a lot of damage to it, but here, let me just light all of this. And, oh, yeah, guys, uh, we might want to stand back for this one. Everyone, stand back. Let's go. And, oh, uh, hold on. Uh, I, I I don't think that worked as well as I thought it was gonna work. Did your volcano just implode? I think it exploded more on the inside than the outside. Let's go check out the damage and... Oh, yeah, uh, it kind of, uh, exploded more on the inside. It was supposed to, like, blow up on the outside and be cool and all that, but, uh, this works. This kind of looks cool. All right, well, let me show you how a real eruption happens. All right, I have a uh, here. Hold on. I gotta get out of my volcano real quick. I'm gonna stuck down here, and, all right, uh, I guess let's see your volcano erupt. All right, well, whenever you're ready, I'll show you how a real eruption happens. All right, all right, go for it. We're waiting. All right, well, this is what I like to call, uh, 8,000 blocks of TNT. And, uh, what the heck? Oh, Wait, what? no. I can barely see anything. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Uh, everything is blowing up and... Uh, Cam, I, I don't think there's an eruption. I think this is uh, like a full explosion. You're, you're just blowing up your entire volcano. What the heck? This is kind of beautiful. Whoa! Everything just blew up! Everything just disappeared! That's how you erupt. That was not an eruption. That was a self-destruction right there. Whoa, that was intense. All right, well, anyways, what do you guys rate my volcano now? Uh, after my eruption and your uh, implosion, I'd give it a five. Well, I'll give him a solid eight. The roller coaster was really fun. And Wait, eight? Okay, that means me and you are tied, Cam. Uh, my volcano was way better. Mine is uh, still alive. Yours just blew no, up. No, 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 no. My volcano was so much and, better. Dude, your thing is not even a volcano anymore. It all just blew up. Just imploded. GG's. That was pretty crazy. And if you want to watch the next video, then click on the video on the screen right now.